my PYTs, welcome back to your girl's channel. I am Punch Bree PYT, you know me. If you don't know me, welcome to Punchinella Games. I hope you enjoyed the show. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave your girl a lovely comment down below. Um, today, y'all, I am popping in to say hi. I know I've been MIA for a minute. Um, just adulting and, you know, dealing with life. Y'all know how that goes sometimes. Um, but I built this house for Prince. Um, if you don't know who Prince is, Prince is a sim that I am working on NLP for. I've been working on it for a very, very, very long time. <laughs> and then they announced the high school years pack. And um, I was like, oh, this is perfect because Prince is a team that um, the LP was going to be centered around. So I am building this house for him and his dad. He lives with his father, just them two guys. So um, I wanted to, you know, give them a little, you know, space or whatever, just for them. And this house, actually, there was a house here on this lot and I took everything down except for the foundation. And then I added to the foundation to make it a little bit bigger because the one that was here was only a um, one bedroom. So I um, extended the foundation to make it two bedrooms for him and his dad, um, but I left the original kind of shape a little bit. Um, but anyway, so um, my idea for the house, um, I didn't really have an idea. I never really do too much. I just kind of go in there and do whatever feels right at the time. So um, on this one, I wanted it to match the other houses in the neighborhood. I didn't want it to be too big. I didn't want a mansion because first of all, it doesn't fit the storyline. The storyline is him and his dad by themselves. Um, and his dad is into education a lot and politics. So he's just starting out the father in these careers. I mean, he's he has degrees. Let me let me let me give him his props okay he has degrees but he's just now you know really tapping into these um adventures or careers and so I didn't want him to be living in no gigantic mansion you know he's kind of like you know um the people's champ you know he doesn't come from much he doesn't have a lot but he cares about you know people and the community so I wanted the house to fit that I wanted it to you know look like it's just him and his son and um you know they still have to work really hard to make ends meet and things like that so I didn't want to you know make it overly extra and overly um, decorated and, you know, all the bells and whistles because they simply can't afford that right now. So, um, and as far as the inspiration of, you know, how the house looked and everything, um, of course, like I said, I wanted it to match the area, but I also wanted it to match the area from where like I'm from. Um, Willow Creek, I think is kind of based on, uh, New Orleans or, you know, Louisiana. And that's where I'm from. I'm not from New Orleans. I'm from Louisiana. <laughs> but um, I wanted it to look like, you know, the houses from where I'm from and where my mom lives and stuff, you know, and that's what I see when I go back home and they're very cozy and they're warm and um, some of them are older homes, but, you know, they're the houses that have like what we call the really good bones, you know, but um. Yeah, so I kind of went with that. I went with that Southern. All my houses are Southern. I mean, that's because that's where I live. <laughs> and anything else I build, I have to reach way deep into my imagination. Imagination. Way up there. And, you know, get inspiration from things I see on TV or, you know, places I might have traveled to. But um, because I am from the South and I live in the South, um, naturally, that's what I normally build. So, um this house definitely looks like the houses where I'm from and uh, with the porch and all of that. I mean, that's that's Southern living. You always got a front porch. <laughs> you always got a front porch because you got to sit on the porch and sip your lemonade or if you want a beer or whatever. And you sit there and you talk about your neighbors. I mean, that's what you do. So anyway, <laughs> so I went for that look. 
and um again wanted it to match the houses around or whatever um the inside is very very i live here with my dad um it is not completely updated there's certain places that i did make it a little more updated because i wanted it to look like maybe the dad was like working on the home and you know trying to make it um you know bigger or nicer for him and his son so you know maybe they had parts of the kitchen redone or part of the bathroom so i kind of did that so in the bathroom you'll see that they have like an older tile on the floor and um but they have new countertops but the shower is an older looking shower and stuff like that so in the kitchen as well um they have like newer cabinets and stuff but the towel is not the newest towel you know um the appliances aren't the biggest and the best appliances or whatever but they're stainless steel so you know we on our way up there you know we don't have no white refrigerators okay <laughs> like nini say we don't have no white refrigerators <laughs> but um yeah so you know there were certain aspects that i wanted to put into this house to help with the visual of the storyline or whatever so um i will be doing a more in-depth like intro video about him and his dad and where's his mom and all this type of stuff so yeah that'll be coming um and i think the pack comes out at the end of the week or something like that i'm really scared because i think it's gonna tear up my mods but um again y'all i'm really sorry i haven't been posting um just like i said just having some adult issues and life issues and you know but i missed you guys so much and i felt so bad that i wasn't able to put out something <laughs> so i was like okay i'm gonna have to give them something i'm give them a, a cute build really quick or whatever but i did film black widow and that should be out um tomorrow if i'm not mistaken and i actually filmed that one before i filmed this one so i may repeat myself in some aspects don't judge me okay <laughs> i um i just wasn't thinking about the timing of when I was going to release it and what I was saying or whatever. But, um, yeah, so that'll be out and, uh, still working on Jackson family values, new intro. And of course this LP. And, um, I've actually been diving into some of my old stuff. So don't be surprised if you see one of the older LP episodes popping up out the blue to say hello, you know, it brings me joy so you know i think i'll <laughs> might post it or whatever but um i hope you guys enjoyed this build and i hope that um what i was going for um conveys through through the through the house and everything and i appreciate you all so much thank you so much to my new subscribers and the subscribers who have been here since day one i appreciate y'all so much I am sending you many virtual hugs as usual. And um, if you haven't subscribed and you already know what to do, hit the subscribe button and leave your girl a comment, like the video, hit the bell, all those, all those little things like that. Y'all know what to do. And um, I will see y'all in the next video. Bye, PYTs.
Some more, girl. You know that there ain't nobody 